types of magnetic material. First one will take diamagnetic substance or diamagnetic material. On the basis of mutual interaction or behavior of various material in the external magnetizing field, the material are divided mainly into three categories. First one we have taken diamagnetic material. Diamagnetism is the intrinsic property of every material and is generated due to mutual interaction between the applied magnetic field and the orbital motion of the electrons. So diamagnetism is the intrinsic property of every material and it is generated due to mutual interaction between the applied magnetic field and orbital motion of electrons. Suppose a material in which individual atom does not have any net magnetic moment when such material is placed in magnetizing field. This is the direction of external field. This is B0. This is Bm. When such material is placed in magnetic field, dipole moments are induced in the atom by the applied field. The magnetic field due to induced magnetic moment opposes the original field. Thus, the resultant field inside the material is smaller than the applied field. These type of materials are called diamagnetic materials. So total magnetic field here will be B is equal to B0 minus Bm. Magnetic moments are induced in all the material whenever a magnetic field is applied. Thus all materials have property of diamagnetism. However, if there is a permanent atomic magnetic moment, then para and ferromagnetism is much stronger than the diamagnetism and the material does not show the diamagnetic properties. Suppose a material in which individual atom does not have a net magnetic moment when such a material is placed in a magnetic field. Dipole moments are induced in the atoms by the applied fields. The magnetic field due to induced magnetic movement opposes the original field. The magnetic field due to the induced magnetic movement opposes the original field. Thus, the resultant field inside the material is smaller than the applied field. This type of material is called diamagnetic material. The external field is in this direction. This is B0. Whereas the induced field in the material is Bm. So what we get it is B is equal to B0 minus Bm. So the net field is smaller than the applied field. These type of materials are called diamagnetic material. Magnetic movements are induced in all the material whenever the magnetic field is applied. Thus, all materials have property of diamagnetism. Magnetic moments are induced in all materials whenever a magnetic field is applied. Thus, all materials have the property of diamagnetism. This is the first type we have. Second type is paramagnetic material. Now, consider a material whose individual atoms have a net magnetic moment when such a material is placed in the magnetic field, an extra magnetic field produces in the material in the direction of the field. This is the external field B0. Now there is a material magnetized. So this is Bm. B0 direction is in this because of the alignment of the dipole. Thus the resultant magnetic field in the material is greater than the applied field. The tendency to increase the magnetic field due to magnetization of the material is called paramagnetism and the material is called paramagnetic material. Now consider a material whose individual atoms have a net magnetic moment. In these substances, the inner orbit of the atoms are incomplete. Electron spins are uncoupled. Consequently, an applied magnetic field, on applying a magnetic field, the magnetic movement generated due to the spin motion aligns in the direction of the field induces magnetic movement in its direction due to which the material gets feebly magnetized. These materials, the electron number is odd. Now consider a material whose individual atoms have a net magnetic moment. That is, the inner orbits of atoms are incomplete. The electron spins are uncoupled. Consequently, on applying a magnetic field, the magnetic moment generated due to spin motion align in the direction of magnetic field. The resultant magnetic field in the material is then greater than the applied field. 
the tendency to increase the magnetic field due to magnetization of material is called paramagnetism and material is called paramagnetic material so here the magnetic field is b not magnetic field bm the total magnetic field b is equal to b not plus bm now we'll study ferromagnetic substances in some substances the permanent atomic magnetic moments have strong tendency to align themselves even without external field these materials are called ferromagnetic material in every unmagnetized ferromagnetic material the atoms form domains inside the material different domains however have different directions of magnetic moment hence the material remains unmagnetized on applying external field these domains rotate and align in the direction of magnetic field because of the domain character of ferromagnetic material even a small magnetic field is applied gives rise to large magnetization the magnetic field is much larger than the applied field in such a material in some materials the permanent atomic magnetic moments have strong tendency to align themselves even without any external field these materials are called ferromagnetic materials in every unmagnetized ferromagnetic material the atoms form domains inside the material here domains are shown these are all atoms which having the same magnetic moment align themselves different domains however have different directions of magnetic moment therefore the material remains unmagnetized now we applied the magnetic field on applying an external magnetic field these domains rotate and align in the direction of magnetic field so these domains align they will rotate and align themselves in the direction of the field all the domains align themselves in the direction of field because of the domain character of ferromagnetic materials even if a small magnetic field is applied gives rise to large magnetization the resultant field is much larger than the applied fields in such materials because these domains also are aligning along the same direction